folks, in today's video tutorial I'm going to show you and explain the TriPAR functionality with Sweep feature. We will start from scratch and we will create 3D model as TriPAR name. If you work with Sweep feature, you know that it is necessary to create a sketch. We will create simply straight line and over here with some dimension here and over here I will use the sweep feature. If I will jump into sketch the system allowed to me to create the base sketch so for example we would like to follow the circle with diameter 30 regarding the just created sketch. You see it is not changed the question is, if you would like to use the tripar, how the system will change diameter regarding the length of the curve. We will jump back to the sketch and directly in the sketch we will create in the tools relation we will manage this diameter. So SD3 we would like to have at the beginning in number 30 millimeters here yeah? and then plus and I will use the bracket for better explanation. We know that parameter tripar is at the beginning of the curve as the zero value and at the end number one. What does it mean? That if you would like to have at the end for example diameter 80 so you know that 30 plus 50 is 80 altogether but at the beginning of the curve will be 30 and at the end will be 30 plus 50. So what does it mean? I will use the functionality pair tripar and right now calculate with me one more time. If you put at the beginning of the curve over here, over here you place the 0, the system will count 30 plus 0 equal 30 at the end of the curve 30 plus 50 because this one is 1 yeah so what does it mean 30 plus 50 is 80 so what together will be 80 I will finish and you can see right now that is necessary jump here that you would like to allow section to change and right now if I will finish and confirm OK so you see that it is possible to use these variables. If we will create another example I will start again from the scratch and we will create new sketch again straight line for example length will be 500 millimeters doesn't matter 15 OK and right now we would like to manage the different sketch or for example a little bit complicated so we will create Swift feature again. We will jump to sketch and over here I would like to use something from the palette. For example profile and we can choose for example this shape. Simply drag in the middle and then you can set your custom scale with some numbers. Okay. What is necessary to do is that you would like to manage for example high so this one at the beginning is 80 and another one you can change dimension like 1 so for example 50 and 20 and it's okay what does it mean again we will drive the high of this parameter that at the beginning will be 80 and at the end will be for example 160 what does it mean you can check if it is possible to change by this dimension. Select 160, OK, looks great. Go back, perfect. And at the end, for example, will be 100. Again, it's working. So you can check how the system will change dimensions and how it will be looks like at the end. And right now, necessary to create the tools relations and again we will use this dimension equal 
Ah, uh, at the beginning, you remember? No problem. You can jump here and system will change the information for you. So 80 plus and 80 per tripar. Yep. And same for second dimension. So you can simply copy and paste and only change this one. And you know that this one was 50 and we test that 100 altogether. Simply confirm OK and sketch confirm OK. It's straight and if you change here the system will use what you want. Confirm OK and everything is ready to use. The question is if you would like to edit the source path so the first sketch so you can simply select the definition and for example you can add the arc here yeah and system automatically create tangent connection it's up to you if you would like to update it or not and you can set up your custom dimensions and if you confirm finish you see the system still continue with the sweep feature and base dimension so at the beginning the base dimension is 80 and at the end is 160 and this for example curve length is you can simply to check that the end curve is 100 and beginning curve is 50 so yes please if you would like to change anything here you need to jump into sweep feature and the shape is based on the dimensions and for example you would like to manage this one so at the end we don't want to use the 50 but and sorry we don't want to have a 50 plus 50 but for example 50 plus 75 yeah so altogether will be 125 and if you come from ok and we will confirm the sketch we can simply analyze that final end shape is based on the length as 125 as we need. I hope so that you like this example how to use an understanding of the tripar. Please stay tuned and share my know-how. Bye-bye. Vladimir.